hand in hand. They worked hand in hand. And uh, God, God is a God of faith. Uh, can we say also that God is a God of hope? Amen. We can absolutely say that. Uh, and we can also say, if we think about it, we were made in the image and the likeness of God. All right? Mm -hmm. What are some of the characteristics of God? Love. Love. God is love. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Holy. God is holy. God is merciful. Long suffering. Huh? God is long suffering. Sorry. Sorry. God is sorry. God is good. God is awesome. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and 
and righteously Amen. according to the scripture. Amen. 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 And what what Paul did, let's read that verse again. Hebrews chapter 5. Uh, Hebrews chapter 11 and verse 1. Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, uh -huh. the evidence of things not seen. Now, what causes me and what causes you to achieve in God is the same thing that caused him to achieve. It's faith. Amen? Amen. Amen. You've got to believe by faith what God has said about you. Amen? Amen. Thank you. Amen. Circumstances doesn't deter what God has said. Am I right? Amen. Situations don't deter what God has said. Nope. Nope. If it did, he wouldn't be sorry.
sisters came to my house that evening some 30 something years ago mm. and um, you know they said do you believe what the word says yeah. you know and, and they read the word of God to me you know and said you know do you believe that Jesus was the son of God you know and I did all that by faith everything was on the precipice of faith yeah. you know and so as we talked more they said do you believe that the Lord wants to give you the Holy Ghost? Do you believe you can have it? I said, yes. Yeah. And they said, you know, hallelujah is the highest praise you can give him. Thank you. Start praising him for the gift in advance. Yeah. And as I begin to close my eyes and start praising mm. him on the platform of faith yeah. for the gift or the hope yeah. in advance, I was filled with the precious gift of the uh, Holy Ghost. That faith and hope showed up with together. Uh, now, notice, the hope gave her the ability to pray. Yes. Uh, in spite of Thank you, Jesus. Uh, your hope gives you the ability to continue Hallelujah. to endure. Yes. Uh, to trust Yes. Uh, to hold yes. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, uh, to come out of mm -hmm. uh, uh, To rest in ah. uh, uh, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm. It's activated by faith, but it's endured by hope. Hallelujah. Uh, hope would be a verb, uh, an action verb. 
to yeah. keep it going. Uh, to, to, no matter what you're going through, uh, to keep it moving. Uh, to hold you steady. Uh, why? Because you're hoping in a sovereign law uh, that's in control of everything. Uh, I'm not hoping in, 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 in my mortgage company. I'm not hoping in my bank account. Thank you. Uh, people without a hey! marriage. Yeah. All right. This hope that we're talking about tonight is not seen with the human eye. That's right. It's seen with the spiritual eye. Come on. Yeah. So this hope that we're talking about is really talking about the visions of God. Am yeah. I right? Absolutely. All right. What God has in store for us, eternal life and whatever else that it takes to go along with that. That's the vision. That's the hope. Yeah. And, and hope is, is what whole, uh, whole faith, it keeps faith up so yeah. we can keep reaching. Thank you. Yeah. Absolutely. They go hand in hand. 
Well, what did you see before that? She got Hagar. She got Hagar. <laughs> huh? Try to hijack the process. Mm, yeah. Try to help God. Mm. <laughs> Have you ever tried to help God? Uh -huh. <laughs> Messed it up. Huh? Messed it all up. Hijack the process. Jacked it up. Too. <laughs> Steal his glory. Mm. Jacked the process. <laughs> uh, not, not, not. She didn't let God be sorry. Oh, oh. Yes. Uh, so you process, you don't allow God to be sorry. My God, my God. Yeah, I like Hallelujah. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. God wants to be God all by himself. All by himself. He doesn't need an assistant God. No. <laughs> Expectation. And there it is. He said, 
Hope maybe it's what? Not today. Not all that we appreciate you. You got hope in you. Thank you, Jesus. No. Because it goes contrary to who he is. When they can get father, a lot of child be ashamed when they can do help, but but they want to sit there and build it and help. Amen. Now, when they can get mother, huh? Uh, uh, 
I appreciate it. Thank you, Lord. This is direction. This is instruction. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Even when it comes to a little child, I was working in the daycare. Mm -hmm. And the little girl said, Mr. Frank, can I have this? And I said, well, she asked me if she wanted it. Mm -hmm. You know what she said? Aren't you the boss? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> All righty, then. Because he's not going to stand. 
to where I needed to be. Uh -huh. Daddy came out, then mama came out. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Got me to where I needed to be. No, it's not about the Bible. Let's call God a female. I want y'all to think of calling God a female. Amen. Thank um, you, Jesus. But you see what I'm saying? Right. Uh, his attributes showed up. Yeah. Healed my mind. Healed my spirit. Yeah. Encouraged my heart. Did I get a woman? Yes. Uh, was it good for me? Yes. Did it help me? Yes. Uh, uh, did God bless me? Yes. yes. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Uh, I told him last week, last week, I think it was in Sunday school, uh, that, that we ought to be thankful that some prayers are answered. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, we ought to be grateful that some prayers are answered. Uh, and are you grateful that yes. when Jesus he prayed, Lord, remove this cup? Mm. Uh, uh, are you grateful that that man was master? Yes. Uh, he, he prayed, sweat came down his face like great cups of blood. Uh, uh, he prayed, Father, remove this cup. Mm. Uh, uh, aren't you glad that God didn't hear that prayer and answer that prayer? Right. Uh, there, there's some prayers that we pray that we should Thank you. That God didn't hear. Yeah. Uh, that God didn't move on. Yes, God. Amen? Amen. Uh, what's his name? Saul. Paul. He prayed. Uh, he prayed that God. Uh, uh, when he received that thorn in his flesh. My God. Uh, then he prayed. Yeah. Uh, he prayed. He said, to, as Jesus, Jesus removed this thorn. He prayed that what? Twice? How many times? Three, Three times. Yeah. Amen? And did Jesus move it? Uh, no, and, and Jesus spoke to him. Uh, out of a, uh, in my mind, my Holy Ghost mind, I fired on this God. Uh, and out of a still small voice, it said, My grace is sufficient for me. Amen? And when Paul received that revelation, he said, Therefore, therefore, gladly <laughs> will I glory uh, in my infirmity, uh, in my weakness. Because it's part of the revelation that when I am weak, then I'm almost strong. You, you're strong at your weakest point. Yeah. Uh, that's, 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 that's God. That's understanding God. Yeah, God. Uh, at the weakest moment in my life, am I the strongest if I hold on to God? Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I thank It's opposite with God. Yeah. You think at your weakest moment you're weak, but God says at your weakest moment you're strong. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Uh, oh, my God. I was just thinking a lot of things we pray for. Yes. A lot of things is we want it. Yes. Instead of what we need. Yes. And see, God will give you what you need. Yes. Not what you want because the wants will take you out of the way. Yes. And God has our best interest at heart. All the time. So because we don't get those wants, doesn't mean we don't have faith to believe God. Come on here. Huh? <laughs> but God is looking out for us. Yeah. And he'll give us what we need instead of what we want. Amen. Now, is that valuable information? Yes. yes. Amen. Uh, is that more valuable than gold that perish? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Right. He said the trial of your faith. Is much more precious than the gold that perished. Yeah. So, so when he just said, what I've been trying to say, uh, that 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 gold God does not give you what you want. Mm -hmm. uh, it doesn't negate that God is on your side. Mm -hmm. Amen. 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 Yeah. Hallelujah. Uh, that God can't do it. That, uh, that God won't do it. Amen. Amen. Um, because, no, if, if certain things were given to us, it'll destroy us. Yes. Thank you. Uh, am I right? Amen. That's understanding. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. My, my sister. Uh, Bishop, when you were saying you um, 
have looked at that house and laid your hands on that house and yeah. you already knew that it was out of your price range, but nevertheless, you know, and had God given you that, it would have went against his word. The blessings of the Lord make it rich and yeah. added no sorrow. Yeah. That house is going to bring you some sorrow. It's going to bring some sorrow. Yeah, making them payments. <laughs> but God wasn't going to go against his word.
that the world with the net, the universe, mm. uh, was framed. That word framed there means uh, put in order the way God has designed. That's it, that's it in the next year. I read. So that things which are seen were not made of things which do appear. Huh? That, so that things that we see were what? Things, so that things which are seen. So things that we see were not made of things which do appear. Were not made of things what? Which do appear. Which do appear. God is an awesome God. <clears throat> All right. By faith, Abel offered unto God a more excellent sacrifice than Cain. Okay. Now, we're talking about faith and hope. Mm -hmm. By faith, who? Abel. Abel offered unto God. Offered unto God a more excellent sacrifice than Cain. Than Cain. God. Did God let him die? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Absolutely. Huh? He lived that. Now, will that happen in all circumstances, in all situations? No. Because in this situation, God allowed it to happen for a reason. Amen? Amen. Understanding by faith. God allows certain things to happen in the life of a righteous person for a reason. By faith. Am I right? Now, because Cain, I mean Abel, died, God testified mm -hmm. <laughs> that he was what? Righteous. Yes. Am I right? Yes. Because Cain, oh, because Abel did that was right in the sight of God. Is he better off living or dead? Dead. I did what God had required. I suffered for it. Now I'm with him. Huh? Am I right? So, so when we when we endure certain things for righteousness' sake, mm -hmm. huh? By faith, go through it with an expectation that you're going to be received by God, which is far better than anything else. Thank you, Jesus. This is deep talk right here. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> All this stuff to do what? Suffer. Suffer. That people are going to come at you. Yeah. Huh? Am I right? That's right. Amen. My sister? I thought you had to do People, people, people are going to do some things. Mm -hmm. Like Cain. Am I right? God even might, may allow them even to, to, to stab you a little bit. Mm -hmm. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Thank you, Lord. But, but you know, the Bible says, as, as they said, many are the afflictions of the righteous. Uh, huh? But the Lord. My God. Huh? He does what? That's my expectation. God, That's what I'm holding on to. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Huh? Um, that's, that's what I'm hoping for. Huh? That's what I'm living for. Huh? Um, I, I, we, got, we got a hope, y'all. Uh, we got an expectation, y'all. Huh? Hallelujah. That, that, that we serve a righteous God. Huh? And with every temptation, he makes a way of escape. Huh? And all things are working together for my good. It's working for you. Huh? It's working for you. It's literally revealing to you who God is. Huh? Rest in God. Huh? Hope in God. Am I right? Yeah. All right. Uh, well, let me just say this. Go ahead, brother. I want you to just talk. Hey! Just gonna say that the devil, the devil is the accuser of the brother. The accuser of the brother. Yeah. And his main objective is to destroy you. Yeah. Or by word. Uh huh. <laughs> by weapons. Yeah. He wants to destroy you and make you feel like you can't be saved. You can't be saved, no matter what. You can't be saved. Yeah. But. To have that hope yeah. that lies beyond the grave. Yeah. Uh, when we keep marching forward, keep marching forward. regardless of what's been said yeah. or what's been done, yeah. I'm going to keep serving you, God. Yeah. Uh, until my change comes. Yeah. And that's how we have to be about it. We got to be about it. Thank you. And know that everything <coughs> that you experience is working for your good. Man, man. Huh? 
All things. Because you love God and are the call according to his purpose. Amen? Amen. Y'all with me? Amen. Case in point. Why? Mr. Corey, Mrs. Whitney, and uh, yeah, my wife. <laughs> and Sister Whitney. There you go. We went to Rochester. Mm -hmm. And the lady clowned us. Jesus. Uh, we were trying to get that hotel. Jesus. Uh, went out of her element, went out of her character. Uh, uh, did some did some wicked stuff. Uh, did some wicked stuff. Amen, didn't it? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. So we in Rochester, a whole other city, with no place to stay. My God. No, no hotel room. My God. Yeah. God. God spoke to my heart. He said, all things work together for good. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I sat back, let things play out. Yeah. To them that love God. To them that are be called according to his purpose. Yes, sir. Amen. Let things play out. Uh, don't get upset. Huh? Don't get angry. Don't cuss nobody out. Huh? You follow me? Thank you, Lord. Don't, don't let the enemy say you're going to sleep in your car. Come on. Huh? Thank you, Jesus. Trust God. Trust God. Huh? Went to another hotel. They went and told the, the people what happened. The people got upset. Jesus. Said, how can this be? Who do they think they are? I'm going to call their manager. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Huh? I got to straighten them out. Huh? We're going to get y'all some rooms here tonight. Huh? Huh? All right. They, all things work together for good. Huh? Work together for good. They, they, they helped us with our rooms. Now, this is a separate hotel. Thank you. Gave us discounts. Thank you, Jesus. On our rooms. Look at you, God. Sound like God to me. <laughs> Paid for our dinner. Give us a discount on our dinner. Jesus. Huh? And they gave us free breakfast. Now, this, we talk about a four star, five star hotel. Thank you, Jesus. Whatever it was. We <laughs> talking about the red movie. Motel, uh, come on, come on, come on. Gave us both. Uh, <laughs> Thank uh, you, Lord. And, 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 and bless us. Royalty. Royalty. <laughs> Bishop had an annex. They called the manager and got my money back. Got her money back. <laughs> She actually got more money than she took. Come on, come on! I will fight for you. Come on! Huh? Come on! God! I will give you back! Huh? Hey! Glory! She, she, at first, they returned the money. Uh huh. Then tried to take it back. <laughs> and then the credit card people gave us all the money back then. Oh, so yeah. we got almost double. Double! <laughs> <laughs> She's trying to show herself. Double for your God. Okay, man, just, God. Here's the money back. Yeah. God. Yeah. <laughs> Come on here. Yeah, Let the enemy show himself. Who is the enemy? Come on. Who is he that's fighting against the army of God? Who is that on some side? Come on, Bishop. We die in God showed himself. Yeah. Then he showed himself again. Mike. Then he showed himself Mike. again. Oh, and when we got back to here, he still showed himself. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> glory, glory. He's got a word. Bless the name of Jesus. God got you. God got you. Uh, God got you. Amen. Uh, God got you. Who got you? Uh. Uh. God got you. Hallelujah. I gotta let y'all go now. Four Thank minutes over my time. Mm -hmm. Hey! Come on, give God a praise. Who wasn't serving God like this? Hallelujah.
That's not me and David. David, he, he looked back at Goliath and said, look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. Huh? You are circumcised from, you, I'm going to take off your head huh? and feed it to the bird, the fowls of the air. Yeah. Huh? I said, hey, yeah. hallelujah. And David, when he, when he, by faith, he attacked that giant, God took over. Huh? In that, in that stone. Huh? That stone hit the giant's head, and the Bible said it sunk. <laughs> that tells you God pushed it in. All <laughs> in the giant fell. David went there and cut off the head, showed it to the rest of the Israelites. They all took courage, and the enemy ran and, and, and hid. Amen. What did David do with that head? Took it back to his tent. Took the trophy home. Jesus. I put it on the spear. I showed it. Hallelujah. Huh? So, so, huh? Souvenir. So, so, so when Saul came to David's tent, huh? When the king came to David's tent, huh? huh? The first thing he saw was the trophy. Huh? Huh? The, the ability of God. The purpose of God. The power of God. Come on. When the enemy comes to your camp, he ought to be able to see the power of God. The ability of God. My, oh my God. I'm getting revelation. He should be able to take us to your holy table and hold on that trophy. Jesus. And let this be for me. Uh, you come with me with saved and nerves. Uh, I come in the power of God. Happen after this 